Soil health is the cornerstone and the beginning of any growing operation. Um, without good soil and good soil health, it's very difficult. Growers have to put a lot more inputs um, to make up for what they're missing. There's still a lot that needs to be learned about what a healthy soil actually looks like and how to measure that. But generally speaking, we have a good understanding of doing what we can to encourage soil health, which is trying to maximize the amount of organic matter that we can either add to or, or preserve in the soil. Sustainability, I know, is a, has been a big uh, word that everyone's using. And it goes back to soil health, water quality, uh, sustainability, and that's things that growers in California have been doing for many, many years because our ground is so valuable. We can grow almost year round. We do have good, very, very good soil here in the Salinas Valley. And the families that, that got, first got this ground in the late 1800s have maintained that so that we do have the production we have today. And so it's very much in the forefront of their mind to maintain their soil health the ranch quality to make sure the ranch is producing at the highest rate it can. It's understanding the variability in our field and how that affects the soil health and how we need to alter some of our amendments or management practices to match that field variability. Um, and then trying to do whatever we can to track it over time and see if we're going in a good direction and how we need to correct if we're getting off track. And so that's where a product like mycorrhizal Comes into, comes into play where well, that will actually re, uh, reapply and reinvigorate the soil, if you will. To me, sustainability means take advantage of what's there naturally. 